Hello teachers, today I would like to show you an easy way to create an online quiz using Google Form. This is so easy, it only takes you 3 minutes to complete. I'm also going to show you how to use and recycle the quiz again and again without the students copying each other's answer. Tune in and watch on. Okay, so now you go to Google Drive. From Google Drive, I drag down. And then you can open the Google Forms. In the Google Forms, you can see there are questions and responses that you will receive from the students. Now we go to the settings and click quizzes. So make this a quiz. So it becomes a quiz. Okay, save. Okay. So now let's try to type the questions. So the first question is that let's make it a number game. So the first question is 10. So the first one is let's type in the answer as well. Okay. Now you might want to make it compulsory and click the three dots. You also see you can shuffle the option order. This enable you uh, to make sure every student gets the different questions from different order. So now again, I'm also going to create a second question. Okay, and the third one you can also copy again to create the third question. Okay, now we make sure like all the questions are in shuffle option order. So that's perfect. So now the students will get different questions. Now we type in the title. And after the title, you can also see, you can also type in the answers. So now take a look at the answer key underneath. Click the answer key. Then you will be able to create the correct answer. Okay, done again. I would recommend you to actually do the answer key all together at the end. So you do everything which is um, similar at the same time. Okay, now we finished. Now I would like to actually try to use a different color because I like blue and you can even choose an image to make it more um, appetizing for students. Okay, now we can preview it. Okay, so that's all. Your quizzes are created now. So your quiz it has been created now. All right, that's easy. Afterwards, you can also check, send it. You can send via email links or just via the links and shorten the URL to make it easier to type in if the students are typing in. Okay. And if you like my video ideas, please also watch the other videos. They will show you some more teaching ideas.